Welcome back. This is Mel from Fame Cigars and Wine in downtown Palm Springs. Today we have, with a lot many requests, about this particular Brunello di Montalcino. Usileria, um, a great winemaker. I've met him personally. Superb wines from Tuscany, actually. Montalcino is a small region within Tuscany, which is an ABA. And uh, he uses 100% Sangiovese grapes. The wine or the, the grapes are aged for 36 months in the wooden barrels. And the outcome is phenomenal. Has been rated really high by Robert Parker, wine advocate, James Suckling. You name it, man. It's 95, 97, all over the board. So let's see what the wine tells us. So right off the bottle, the wine is really red, I would say rich red, plum kind of, ruby red is, is, is proper verbiage, I guess. But hey, this is my review. So I'll review it the way it comes to me. So ruby red, let's check the nose. Wow. Perfumed red, red fruits like cherries, blackberries. Oh, well. I get that spice, the spice notes. More, more cinnamony kind of nose to it. The oak presence is there. I would say prominent. That's, yeah, that, that smoky, smoky, smoky nose to it. All right. Enough of nose. I cannot wait diving into it. Oh. Just FYI. I let it sit in the glass for a good 15-20 minutes. It opened up. I aerated the glass, so... Oh. Oh my god, man. I can't... That silky, soft tannins, tannins to it. Very balanced. Yeah. On the palate, it's, it's, it's more plumish, more... more plums to it, like ripe, ripe red fruits. Yeah, that spice character is coming in, kind of like more citrusy, you know, more tangerine, you know, I would not use the word tangerine in, uh, in a white wine, but like that spice to it. I won't let it go. The last last sip, I'll tell you about more about. Oh, the finish. It just lasts long, so long. More cocoa, more chocolate, licorice. You know, like if, like have a have a like a blackberry tart, or you know, more like a pie. Then you have that tartness to it. I really wanted to do this review, so awesome, awesome. This is this is a great opportunity. So let's talk about the boldness of the wine. It's I would say a bold wine. Medium tannins, nothing overpowering. Of course, it's Italian Montalcino, Brunello di Montalcino, what they say. Pretty dry, you know, even drier than your Typical California wines. Acidity is like towards, I would say slightly towards more acidic wine. So it's nice brightness to it. Wow. 
So high ratings, great wine, great pricing. I hope you enjoy it.